minutes is going to take me probably 20, 30 minutes, 40 minutes to get down there. Do you want me to go ahead and just like head your way? And then we can uh, get down there, hop in the blazer, go to AutoZone and stuff? Yeah, that works. Okay, don't fall asleep this time. I'll call you again before I leave. Yeah, I just, yeah, it's fine. Okay, see you in a little bit. Come on. I'm about to head down to Zach's house. I just got off the phone with him a little bit earlier. Make sure he was awake. I believe today we're going to try and get the exhaust cut on off. We got it cut off uh, before the mufflers, but it's still hung. So we're going to try and get it off the hangers and get it out from underneath the truck. And uh, we might go ahead and get some glass packs for it. Here's this thing. It's nasty. Filthy. So I need to clean it just in every way possible. But so yeah, I um, guess I'll see you guys when I get down there. Okay, so what's the plans for today? I have no idea. He just woke up, <laughs> by the way. I had to get him out of bed. Paint the rims and... Oh, we're going to do the other side? Yeah. Okay, we need to clean them then. Do you have any, uh, like, purple power and shit here? No. Okay. And then, what do you decide <laughs> on the exhaust? Or do we know yet? Uh, we'll just get the other zone. We'll get the... How much glass packs are? Or just how much... Just uh, glass packs between is. 20 and 30 bucks, depending on what you get. Yeah, I'm gonna get those. Yeah. Okay, so... Headed to auto zone. Okay. To get... Side pops of this bitch. I forgot my cigarettes. Oh my god. Cigarettos. Glasses. Oh shit! Thank you. Uh, is that your phone ringing? No, that's the radio. Okay, so oh fuck you, dude. <laughs> I was trying to pour the drink. Yeah. Okay. Okay. So, AutoZone to get. Either we'll want a bunch of random piping that we think is gonna work. Maybe some flex piping, maybe glass packs, probably not. I might just have glass packs and you dump out the glass packs. That might be easy for now and then you could just run the red like what where you want to actually end later. What says one I'd say two and a half. Mm -hmm. Yeah, if I'd guess. Um and then the plan for that is to get the rest of the exhaust off. We can always and rig it to where it work. We got two and a half and it's two and a quarter. Just take a hammer and beat it down. But I mean, that's a shitty way to do it, but it would work. <laughs> it would work. There is okay, somebody so driving on the wrong side of the road. They literally drove all the way up through here on the other side on the wrong side of the road. Cars swerving, honking at them and everything. Just and they didn't realize until this red light, yeah. Go ahead and grab you a couple of those. And then, you will need a coupler. Why would you do that? Because the glass pack, you can just slide it up on there. Ideally. But you might not be able to. I don't know, it looks more like two and a quarter, I'm thinking. But that's too bad. Okay, so. Whoop. Leaving AutoZone now. With two glass packs, a couple connectors, and a couple clamps. Hey, Zach, I just thought of something. Each glass. 
You know what? Screw this. Begin the cutoff process. 4:30, so we should be done. There's one. One guy. Okay, so we got all the hangers cut. I think, except for yeah, one on this one. And just got the exhaust out. Hold on. I'll move around and try and help snake that out a little bit. Oh, you got it. Sorry. <laughs> One down. Still got this last hanger right here. There it is. I'm afraid it's gonna like hit me in the head. <laughs> That's what I was worried about. I don't hear. I put my head up here. I don't think I can. There we go. <laughs> about got you. I know. About my head. Okay. And then you pulled through, right? Push it through. Yeah. That's ain't bad at all. I remember my truck. We had to cut it again because there was no way it was going to happen. One of these things open. Dude, I love that color on these things. There's just something about them. That actually looks like that'll go right on that. Big, but they might clamp down. What is this, two and a quarter? Yeah. Uh, I'll hold. So after taking the slot this, hope it'll clamp down a little bit more. You might have to do... Safety 101. Bachelor's or uh, triple C. Yeah. <laughs> Every time, point. Okay. We hold that right there. Okay, so we're actually in the fitment process now. You can see we got them cut, so hopefully it'll. 
kind of let that clamp down a little bit tighter than it would otherwise. That's still not right, like even there. You got quite a bit of thread on this side. Then yes, we know this is gonna leak, but that's besides the point. Last pack. <laughs> Okay, I think you're actually out of, like, running out of thread on the U-bolt is your problem you're hitting. But that's, that's tight, and that's not coming off. It's Dude, it's actually, look at this. It's actually bending this lower bracket. I don't know if you guys will be able to see that or not. But, okay, so we just finished putting the... I like most by a truck. Okay, we just finished <laughs> putting the other glass back on. <clears throat> It didn't take very long at all. You see both underneath are pretty in red. So, now, first start up, since the glass back. Please don't sound like ass. Hold on, let me move. Okay, go for it. Again, screwdriver. Battery. Really? Grab it. That is my car. Oh. That sounds good. It's a lot. It's it made it made it more mild. Clean these. Rusty ass wheels. Are you gonna sand them at all? No. Nope. Okay. Cool. Yeah. I got primer. Are we gonna? Hey, you're taking the center caps off, right? Yeah. Okay. Damn. Just take all my paper towels. Look at that run that's about to form right there. Again, this is how you don't paint. All in one coat. No, no. others there'll probably be more in the future you always do try to get that 67 out there uh... like i said there'll be more in the future <laughs> thank you guys for watching